Before work can start on the installations, the entire work area is carefully checked. This is done by Dreger gas analysts who are notified by fax of where they are to be deployed. For their own protection, all gas analysts carry the XAM5000. Equipped with the very latest measurement equipment, the gas analyst then carries out a number of tests on site. First, the gas analyst conducts an explosive gas and O2 measurement using the XAM7000 gas detector combined with a floating probe. After a few moments, he has the precise measured values. The display shows immediately that there is no risk of explosion here. The readings are documented immediately and later presented to the plant operator. Based on the individual circumstances on site, another measurement is performed according to the measurement strategy. This time the gas analyst uses the Dreger Chip Measurement System CMS. With this instrument, he can conduct substance-specific measurements, and it's precisely during this measurement that the device flags up a relevant reading. At 10 ppm, the benzene content where this crew is working is too high. The Dreger gas analyst cordons off the area and initiates additional steps. Now further equipment from the Dreger shop comes into play. The high benzene concentration is to be reduced by means of ventilation. This is done using explosion-proof fans which are installed inside the area where the crew is working. After 24 hours of ventilation, the gas analyst begins his measurement cycle again. Now that the readings are OK, the gas analyst documents his measurement results and passes them on to the operator. He then gives the green light for the crew to begin work again. Firstly, a continuous gas detection system is installed in the area where the work is to take place. Dreger uses the Dreger Exone 5000 gas detector area monitoring system. These monitors can be individually configured to whichever gases are present in the ambient air. Furthermore, up to 25 devices can be interconnected to create a wireless alarm chain. In the event of a gas alarm inside the area where the crew is working, the Dreger Exone 5000 will not only warn personnel in the local area, but also trigger the alarm on every other device, such as those installed in the vicinity of the safety officers. Next, the lighting is installed. This is also available from the Dreger shop. The lighting is explosion-proof and the isolating transformer is installed outside the area where the crew is working. Only the explosion-proof floodlight is installed inside. The first safety officer takes over his work area and is provided with the following standard equipment. As well as a fire extinguisher, the safety officer is equipped with a gas detector and a horn for sounding the alarm. The safety officer checks the access permit and removes the no-entry sign. It's only now that the contractors are allowed to access their workplaces. Strict regulations and even stricter adherence to them. The duties of the safety officers and the procedures to be followed to protect personnel and equipment are clearly defined. Before a contractor starts work, the safety officer first checks his permits. The time, the worker's name and measured values are likewise documented. The safety officer continues to check the ambient values while work is ongoing. Often it's not possible to eliminate gas concentrations completely. To allow essential work to be carried out nonetheless, safety officers and contractors are given particularly high levels of protection. The safety officer has to wear compressed air breathing apparatus in the immediate vicinity of the manhole. Workers, such as contractors, also need reliable safety equipment, like the Workmaster Pro. This chemical protection suit offers extensive protection against a wide range of chemicals. It can also be combined perfectly with a self-contained respiratory protection system, such as the Dreger Air Pack. The contractor is now suitably protected and can carry out the necessary cleaning tasks for extended periods of time. Of course, all this equipment is available for hire from the local Dreger safety shop. But what if something does go wrong after all? The oxygen concentration where the crew is working suddenly falls. The Dreger Exone 5000 immediately registers the change in the breathing air. Thanks to the alarm chain, the safety officer also realizes immediately that something is wrong. A quick glance is all that's needed and he orders the crew to leave the area immediately. Next, he reports the incident to the chief safety officer by radio. The crew must now leave the work area immediately. Thanks to the precise documentation, 
The safety officer can check instantly that all workers have left the incident zone without injury. He reports immediately if an evacuation has to take place. Thanks to the safety equipment that's already in place, casualties can be rescued within the shortest possible time. Because the safety officer provides full documentation of up-to-date readings and the safety measures initiated, emergency crews can also start their work without any delays.